the continuation of the previous video. Linear linear inequality. Example solve the following maximum is set equal to 3x1 plus 2x2 subject to the constraint minus 2x1 plus x2 less than or equal to 1 x1 less than or equal to 2 x1 plus x2 less than or equal to 3 and x1 comma x2 greater than or equal to 0 solution first consider inequality constraints or equality is minus 2 x1 plus x2 equal to 1 x1 equal to 2 x1 plus x2 equal to 3 and x1 equal to 0 x2 equal to 0 so first all the constraints convert inequality to equality next find out the points minus 2 x1 plus x2 equal to 1 put x1 equal to 0 x2 equal to 1 put x2 equal to 0 here x2 equal to 0 then x1 equal to minus 0 0.5 x2 equal to 2 the third line x1 plus x2 equal to 3 that means x1 equal to 0 x2 equal to 3 put x2 equal to 0 x1 equal to 3 so now draw the graph First line zero comma one zero comma one this point. Minus zero point five comma minus zero point five comma zero is value. Now draw a line. This equation is minus two x one plus x two less than or equal to one. That means this portion, full portion. Next zero comma three three comma zero. 0 comma 3 3 comma 0 3 comma 0 0 comma 3 now draw a line this one. next this line x1 plus x2 less than or equal to 3 the third constraint x2 x1 equal to 2 x1 equal to 2 means this point x1 equal to 2 this line x1 less than or equal to 2 that means this portion and x1 greater than or equal to 0 x2 greater than or equal to 0 so the region this is a region Now the points are this point 0 comma 0 and this point 2 comma 0 and this point and intersection of this point and this point. So now these two lines that is minus 2 x1 
plus x2 equal to 1 x1 equal to 2 x1 equal to 2 means it's minus 4 plus x2 equal to 1 x2 equal to 1 x2 equal to 1 plus 1 why the point a 0 comma 0 let us assume point A that is 0 comma 0 second point this point 2 comma 0 third point x2 equal to x1 equal to 1 yeah this line this intersection point this intersection point using these two lines that means x1 plus x2 equal to 3 x1 equal to 2 so x2 equal to 3 minus 2 that is 1 2 comma 1 so this point is 2 comma 1 2 comma 1 and just find this intersection point this intersection point the intersection of Two x one minus two x one plus x two equal to one. X one plus x two equal to three. The sign change. So minus three x one equal to minus two. So x one equal to two by three. When x one equal to two by three, substitute x one equal to two by three. So x two equal to seven by three. So two by three. 7 by 3 2 by 3 comma 7 by 3 this point this intersection point 2 by 3 comma 7 by 3 the last point this one 0 comma 1 this intersection point so the bounded region so already is it equal to given is it equal to 3 x 1 plus 2x2 so put a x1 equal to 0 now value of z x1 equal to 0 x2 equal to 0 this time 0 2 comma 0 6 2 comma 1 8 2 by 3 comma 7 by 3 that is 20 by 3 this value is 20 so the maximum value is 8 so this is the point corresponding point so the maximum type maximum is it is it is 8 at x1 equal to 2 x2 equal to 1 next example A company manufactures two types of printed circuits. The requirement of Transistors, resistors, and capacitors 
for each type of printer circuits along with the following data transistor transistor resistor capacitor circuit stock available a and b and profit circuit a 15 10 stock availability 180 recent 10 20 stock availability 200 this 15 20 stock availability 210 but profit rupees 5 and rupees 8 how many circuits of each type should be company produce from the stock of and maximum profit solution Let X1 be the number of type type A circuit X2 be the number of type B circuits to produce. Transitor is T 15x1 plus 10x2. Resistor 10x1 plus 20x2. Capacitor 15x1 plus 20x2. And x1 comma x1 greater than equal to 0, x2 greater than equal to 0. Since transistor stock availability is less than or equal to 180 less than or equal to 200 less than or equal to 210 now maximize is it equal to the profit 5x1 plus 8x2 okay. now draw the graph Why? Find out the points 15, 10, 15x1 plus 10x2 equal to 180 equality. So x1 equal to 0, x2 equal to 18. When x2 equal to 0, then x1 is equal to 12. Then next equation 10 x1 plus 20 x2 equal to 200. Put x1 equal to 0, x2 equal to 100.
okay 10 then x2 equal to 0 x1 equal to 20 the third equation 15 x1 plus 20 x2 equal to 2 10 when x1 equal to 0 that is 10.5 0 comma 10.5 when x2 equal to 0 that is 14 x1 equal to 14 so these are the points so first 0 comma 18 15 x1 plus 10 x2 so this point zero comma eighteen then twelve comma zero so here okay we can write four eight twelve sixteen twenty twenty four and etc so one unit we can take four eight twelve sixteen twenty and etc so zero comma eighteen zero comma eighteen and 12 comma 0 12 comma 0 is line so 12 comma 0 0 comma 18 this line is 5 x1 plus 10 x2 less than or equal to 180 second line 10 x1 plus 20 x2 equal to 100 that is 0 comma 10 0 comma 10 this value here 0 comma 10 and 20 comma 0 20 comma 0 this value okay then 14 comma 0 0 comma 10.5 0 comma 10.5 14 comma 0 14 comma 0 this line and this value Fourteen comma zero. This only fourteen comma zero. Zero comma ten point five. Here. So this is a region. Now the points 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, then this point 12, 0, then this point 10, 3, x equal to 10, y is equal to 3. Then this point, section of this point, two comma nine. Two comma nine. This point, zero comma. 
So these are the boundary points 0, 0, 12, 0, 10, 3, 2, 9 and 0, 10. Find the value of Z equal to 5x1 plus 8x2. When 0, 0 that value is 0. Second one 12, 0 that value is 60. Third one 74. Fourth one 82. Fourth one 80. So here maximum value 82. So corresponding vertex to comma 1. So maximum of Z equal to 82 at x1 equal to 2, x2 equal to 9.